Kate Middleton has helped calm fiery and one speculant Prince William royal expert claims. Kate, Duchess of Cambridge has been by Prince William's side for half of his life. The couple met during their first year at university in 2001. Nineteen years later, Kate is married to the 38-year-old prince and they share three children. During their years together as friends, lovers, and spouses, Kate has helped calm the fiery and one speculant William. Royal expert Camilla Tomini claims, when the world expected Prince William to propose, he broke up with Kate Middleton. When William and Kate first met at the University of St. Andrews they became fast friends. They wouldn't take their friendship to the next level until a year later when Kate walked the runway in a charity fashion show. According to E! News, their first kiss happened during the after party. It was clear to us that William was smitten with Kate. A friend who witnessed the moment told author Katie Nichol for her 2011 book The Making of a Royal Romance. He actually told her that she was a knockout that night, which caused her to blush. William and Kate tried to keep their romance a secret. But in 2003, cameras caught William with his arm around Kate during a ski trip in the Swiss village of Klosters. From that point forward, everyone knew Kate was the special woman in William's life. In late 2005, Kate spent Christmas with William at Sandringham and sent royal engagement rumors into overdrive. Throughout 2006, the UK press and odds makers were waiting for William to put a ring on it. But instead of getting engaged, William cancelled his 2006 Christmas and New Year's Eve plans with Kate. He broke up with her in March 2007. Kate Middleton has helped calm the fiery and one speculant Prince William. Royal expert Camilla Tomini recently wrote a piece for The Telegraph to explain how William became the royal family's resident grown-up. Tomini writes that those who are close to the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge give Kate and her family credit for the change in William over the years. Tomini writes that they've helped pull back and calm the fiery William. She also gives credit to William's team, including his former private secretary Simo Case, who have helped him realize his ambitions. The royal expert claims that Case helped boost William's statesmanlike image with a speech he gave in March. William spoke in Ireland and said that his family was determined to help the UK and Ireland maintain their bond in the wake of Brexit. Prince William also took part in a new conservation documentary titled A Planet for Us All. According to Express, viewers have called the doc outstanding. They also insist that the late Princess Diana would be so proud of her oldest son. Tomini claims that Prince William is now taking on the role of People's Prince. He is free to do so because he is no longer overshadowed by Prince Harry. The royal expert claims that William's calm and thoughtful demeanor is a complete 180-degree turn from the old reports about the hot-headed prince's petulance. New documentary shows Prince William is at peace with himself. In A Planet For Us All, cameras followed William for two years as he traveled around the UK. He also traveled to Pakistan and Tanzania while advocating for people to get involved in planet conservation. One scene features William opening a bug hotel known as Buggingham Palace during a visit to a Liverpool primary school. Tomini says that the doc shows William's self-deprecating and candid side. In her article, Tomini wrote that the documentary showed that Prince William was at peace with himself. While constantly facing questions about his family amid the Megxit scandal, William kept his sense of humor. Following his exit, Tomini says William is making appearances that many believe would have been a better fit for Harry. Surrounded by primary school children with worms in their hands, the visit to All Saints Catholic Primary School in Liverpool was full of potential pitfalls, Tomini wrote. Yet as the touching exchanges between the future king and these inner-city children revealed during Monday's TV documentary on the environment, it is William, not Harry, who is taking on the role of the people's prince.